So uh, we've um, <laughs> <laughs> we're just looking through the app store because uh, basically we fucked the first episode up. We are semi professionalish and uh, <laughs> so we're, this is our second episode of the night. But you won't see the first because it's shit. And um, it was pretty boring. Yeah. So we're looking through the app store. <laughs> oh, I was just casually looking through the app store while we were setting up for, <laughs> for, for episode two. I found an app. Uh, so basically, it's... Uh, <laughs> I don't know if this is like advertising, but if you want free advertising from two idiots with a fan base of 12, uh, Peanut. <laughs> so basically, we found an app Oh, called I- uh, Peanut. Uh, it's going to put Tinder to shame. <laughs> it's going to... Tinder's not going to get a look in <laughs> after Peanut. Basically, so it's called Peanut, and it's Tinder for mothers who uh, want <laughs> <who wanna, laughs> <laughs> Peanut is, a, is an app for mums to meet other like-minded mums and talk about mum things. Now, are we making an account is the next question. Ah, shall I install it? And But the thing is, and it genuinely is like, it genuinely is like Tinder. But you swipe left and right. It is. Oh, my God. So you actually talk like Tinder with mothers. Now, the... So, I no, I don't know. It's, it's mothers talking to other mothers. Yeah, yeah. It's not a dating site. Even though it's classed as dating. It's uh, basically... It's called Peanut Mums Meet. Feel free to check it out. And it's basically just... It's Tinder for mothers who can see other mothers in the area with this common interests and get together and do mum things so but i was told mother mothers know best so which one of the mothers know best and that's the point and the, the, if i was single the sleazy part of me would download this and think mm, easy i don't know why we we're not making an account i would <laughs> love to have because a chat with some not, mothers so about we, motherly things i am very paternal so basically we're not we're not installing peanut on this episode because i've downloaded an app that's gonna be it's, it's, it's public oh. service it's public service this one's called questions to ask a girl all oh, right I see. <laughs> I see where this is going so- so I'm going to try a couple of these out on Andrew. These I knew t- I'd be the girl. <laughs> Why am I always the woman? I, I got the phone. So, basically, <laughs> would I like to... Uh, so, like, comment, and scr- subscribe for the next video if you would like me to ask Andrew a funny question, a flirty question, a witty, happy question, a conver- a conversation question. Is that what it says? Yeah, conversation. You can't wow. even spell conversation right. This app is fantastic. Uh, a first date question. A deep question. Should we do all of these a conversation? Family questions. and friends question. A know her better question. Or never ask these questions. So I'm gonna just go ahead and ask Andrew a deep question. Okay. So I've gotta think I've gotta answer this from a perspective of a, a woman or myself. No, you are gonna ask it as yourself. So Alright, as myself. We're gonna get to know Andrew a bit better in the show. Alright. Scroll up and down and stop on the first question that tickles my pickle. Not first time now this is a deep question. Okay. This is in the deep question category. Right. <laughs> Hit me with it. There's two. I'm going to have to ask them both. Okay. <laughs> have you ever peed in the shower? Yes. Well, I mean, who hasn't? I mean, de- don't totally pee in that's the shower. That's a deep question, mind. That's not a deep question. That's, that's, this Was is the a water deep? deep? Was the shower, so no. Well, it's not deep. Right? So, the second deep question. After eating... Do amphibians have to wait one water before getting in the water? I mean, you guess you're thinking. But it doesn't make sense. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Basically, what, what they're trying to say is amphibians go in the water. So they try to ask, what? So, after eating, do amphibians have to wait one hour before getting, oh, getting out of the water? That still doesn't make any sense. Oh, no, it's because they live in water. Ah, oh. but they don't really live in water because they're amphibious, which means they they live on both water and land. So isn't that what amphibious means? Yeah, that they can live on both. No, amphibious is if they can live in both water and land. Yeah. So why would they? Why would they don't need to wait? I won't lie. I actually shit myself. Emma then pros fell down. I absolutely uh, did shit. I'm my quite head. concerned about the sofa. Uh, right. 
Let's ask another. I tell you, we've had a deep question. Nah, those were shit. They, that was a pretty shit deep. As deep questions go. Let's uh, let's get to know Andrew better. That's what the people want. This is what people want. They want to get this to is know the me know better. Her better. So Andrew, are there any causes you strongly believe in? Ah, oh, there's plenty of causes I strongly believe in. Um, legalized marijuana. Legalized marijuana. <laughs> legalized. Legalized. Come on, we're talking about a lot of things. Um, <laughs> Please, for the people, shove your fist in his ass. I you need not... to do a fully charged strength attack and I shove it in the bum. I'm not going to do that right now. Um, but yeah, I fully believe marijuana and LSD should be legalized. LSD, I'm not so happy with it. Because... I've never done any, but... Uh... I, I think both those things are fine. Um, I, another cause I believe in is... Um, uh, uh, I don't know. Look after the whales. whales we are, are a struggling country. No, I mean, not the animals. <laughs> <laughs> Look after them. They, they, Don't fall down it. They're pretty cool people. Yeah, all right. Animals, even. They are pretty cool. They're pretty cool. Let's not hunt them. Uh, there we go. Yeah, yeah. This is genuinely a question in Get to Know You Better. I'm going to read the, I'm going to show you the top one. You can read it out. And why. <laughs> so, why, I think. <laughs> and why. We should legalize. No context. And why. Well, first of all, Simon, I think we should legalize marijuana because <laughs> I, 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 I quite like getting stoned. <laughs> to be honest with you. I you don't see why they people can get drunk and enjoy themselves. I can't get a little high. Yeah. Like Towley. I'm just going to get a little high. <laughs> right. Let's, uh, so we don't want to know Andrew better. Let's ask Andrew a uh, flirty question. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, Andrew. Oh, I'm quite prone to a flirty question. Ah, uh, we've just had a uh, pop-up. Oh, we've got an advert. Brilliant. Oh, uh, now, I don't know if this is offensive or not. Is it? I'm not going to read it out. What is it? Basically, it's a, um... Oh, is it the advert? The advert is quite offensive. It's not offensive, because it's an advert and it's a dating app. It's, uh... No, we'll leave it. Let's go back and ask the question. No, nothing can be offensive if it's an advert on a dating app. No, I can't. Was that racist? No, that's an advert on a dating app. Andrew, I'm going to ask you this question. This yeah. is a flirty question because I'm currently wearing shorts yeah. and a vest with my left breast hanging out. Okay. Three parts of the body specifically in at uh, being out. Right. Do you find tattoos te uh, sexy? Yeah, of course I do. I've got one. Let me just uh, ask you that question again. Andrew, do you find tattoos sexy? Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when you look at me like that, not so much. End the episode. <laughs> uh, when, when you look at me like that, no. Yeah, no. My girlfriend has tattoos, and, you go. and she's hot. Here we go, we got another. Has Sophie got tattoos? Yeah. Oh, she never. Yeah. What's she got? She's got um, a heart, yeah. Like an actual anatomical heart. What's she never? Yeah, and she's got um, some cherries on her leg. Ah, I didn't know that. Here we go. Um, this is a good one. Yeah. I've just realised I'm fighting... Uh, Father Gascoigne. ...without levelling up. I haven't levelled up or anything yet. Ah, uh, and you aren't... Oh, you aren't... You fucking... You can't even leave the area. I mean, I'll fight him if you want. I can beat him first goal. Well, I'll beat him first goal. Well, the thing is, you just got to kill him in one hit. I, I can beat him easy. I just... I won the music box. Oh, fuck, yeah. I, I'd rather have that before yeah. starting this. Yeah. I can't get out of here now, can I? You can use your hunter's mark or you lose all your souls. I, there's no point then, I'm going to fight him and try and beat him. Yeah, go on, yeah. may as well, have a go, have a bash. So, Andrew, Yeah. another question for you. Yeah? What's the naughtiest thing you've ever said to someone? Um, oh. We won't name names so they can't get embarrassed. Well, I, I, oh, I've said a few things to a few people, to be honest. Um, what about, um... What, what was the question? What's the naughtiest thing you've ever said to someone? Naughtiest? Naughtiest. Um. Oh, I don't know. Put more syrup on that. Oh, you filthy fucker. I don't know. I don't you know. I do fucking... not know. Oh, you dirty bastard. I. Oh, dirt. I tell you what. Dirtiest thing. That's I've ever... what they mean. Dirtiest. Oh, dirtiest thing I've ever said to someone. Fucking hell. That's Go on easy. Go on the next episode of Game of Thrones on, you fucking slag. Oh, that was last night with me. It was, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good times. Um, 
No, I, I'm not, uh, I'm not willing to go into that. No. No. Right. No, I don't think people want to know, to be honest. I do. That's why I asked. I'll tell you later. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, uh... I'm gonna freak. I'm gonna freak. <laughs> I'm gonna freak. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna guess. You never answered my question. What? You never answered my question for the last episode, I just remembered. More question. If you, uh, had to choose, gun to your head, between being fucked in the ass by three men... Oh my god! <laughs> which is done by six. It's not, uh, not either. You've got to pick one. I don't want to. You have to. Gun oh, to I don't head. have to. It's not a gun to my head. Where's this gun? I'll get it. No. I, I don't like either of those situations. That's the point in the question. So, oh, go on then. Give me the, what are the choices again. Uh, getting fucked in the ass by three men. Yeah. Sweet blood. Or jizzed on by six. And it's not a homophobic question because it's something that Andrew's not into. He's not into. Right. If he was gay, I'd say you have to sleep with three women. Or... Get peed on by six. So I have to either sleep with three men. Yeah. Or get jizzed on by six. Yeah. I am I the power bottom when I'm getting fucked by the three men, or can I get involved in the fucking like? No, you're getting power bottom. Oh god. It's like you are the taker in both situations. Actually. Okay. Um. You know the problem is, if you die to him, you lose your souls. You can't level up. 